Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm so excited to share with you my top 5 iPhone 15 Pro Max cases. Sure, the naked iPhone is a beautiful piece of tech, but we need to protect it. There are a few simple requirements that a case must have in my opinion, which are grip, design and build quality, so let's dive in. Ok, so starting from the Aulumo A15 in TPU, the touch and feel is pretty good. A little bit slippery compared to the other one we'll see next, but this TPU is so well made and premium. The magnets. Magnets as always in Aulumo cases are very strong, the same as the vegan one, so pretty pretty strong, strong enough. The design. Design is stunning. Since last year when I tried for the first time a Holumu case for my iPhone 14 Pro Max I was really impressed by their unique and futuristic design. In both the leather one and the TPU one there is a section for CPU cooling. It works, I don't know for sure, but I trust them. Protection. I honestly feel pretty safe with this case. I'm not worried about filling down my phone or crashing it, but for sure because of the thinness and the lightness is not safe as the rugged one. Ok, the second one is the Holumu A15 Vegan. Touch and feel. The touch and feel is awesome, the leather offers an awesome grip and the case fits perfectly on the iPhone, it's pretty lightweight and slim. Magnets. Magnets are very strong, strong enough to touch MagSafe accessories safely and don't worry about losing for example the wallet or the power bank in your pocket. The design. Design is great, it's not easy to find a leather case with a nice design or at least with an original design but this one absolutely is and the metal grid for the CPU cooling is a unique detail. The protection. The case is thin and light as the TPU one so the protection is good but not extreme. Let's move on to the Spigen Haramid Enzo. Touch and feel. Touch and feel is awesome. It's a combination of a ramen fiber on the back and the TPU on the edges. It's perfectly combined to return an amazing design and grip. Magnets. This year Spigen has done an incredible job with magnets. They are insanely strong, maybe sometimes too much. They literally takes off my magnets charger from the base and I love them. I prefer having strong magnets because it makes me feel more confident using them with all kinds of accessories. The design. Design for Spigen has never been a problem. I used their cases for years because of their unique design and stunning build quality and this year is even better. This Enzo is by far my favorite in the Thai collection because it fits great and the build quality is incredible, the details with the buttons and the camera bump are impressive. The protection. The case is not the slims or the lightest I've ever used but I think it's in the middle. It's the right compromise for having a beautiful and stylish design with a very confident protection. The next one is the Banks Kevlar Armor. Touch and feel. Touch and feel is awesome as well. This is the first case I have with this particular material, the Kevlar, and I'm pretty surprised how it feels in my hand. The grip is simply amazing, probably the best of the selection. Magnets. Magnets are similar to Aulumo, which are strong enough to use safely your accessories, but not extremely strong as the Spigens. Design. Of course, if this case is in this video and in my top 5, it's because I think it has a stunning design. It's all pretty minimal with this great metal frame around the camera, which is very protective and beautiful at the same time, and the case itself looks very, very clean. Protection. All the edges are covered well. The material seems pretty nice for absorbing crashes and arts. Of course, the strongest part is the metal protection around the camera bump, which is very, very, very solid. The last but not the least is the Hunter D Aspen. Touch and feel. This is the only one of this selection made of full grain leather, which means that's pretty different from the others. As you know, because of the material, when this type of leather is brand new, it's a little bit slippery in the hand. Meanwhile, you're using it, the case forms a little patina on it that gives a unique look and an extra grip. 
This is the good and the bad of the full grain leather case. I personally love this. The magnets. Magnets are good, probably the case with the least strong magnets of all the others, but you can still use safely your favorite MagSafe accessories. Design. Design is so minimal and I love it so much. Looks very premium and elegant, very very classic style. Protection. The case is thick enough to protect properly your device and fits very tight, so the feeling is to have a really well protected phone. So is there a favorite among these? I normally change between these five frequently, but the one I use most often is definitely Spigen. I hope you like this video, you can find all the links to the products in the description, follow me on Instagram, on X, see you soon.